Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back for another Vintage Cube Draft here on Magic the Gathering Online. Not to be confused with MTG Arena. We're going to do a stipulation here. One of them is K -K -K Combo must take any parts of infinite combos. Veto's only for power. If it goes in, you must... If it goes infinite, you must take it. Let's see how many combos we can get. That's from Danny DB. And then we have Swords and Angels. Power can override step. And that's from Danny DB. So, depending on what we open here for the first pick... We're going to see what direction we're going to go. <clears throat> Did my mouse die? I can't find my... No, here it is. Okay. Oh, <laughs> well. Okay, that unfortunately does not put us in any direction. But there is an angel. And there's no infinite combo in here. But this will probably come back, which could bode well for us. Either way, I'm taking this Ancestral Recall. That's not really... That's not really... <clears throat> did you see where Arena wants to draft Ad Q? No, I did not see that. I did not. None of these cards go infinite. None of them are swords either. So I think we're still open. Oh, we'll just take Sheldock. Sheldock seems great for, for either deck, right? I'm running away, but I have a question that you could turn into an article. What are your top 10 cards in this cube? That's a good question, Nick. That's a real good question. I like it. I like it. <coughs> infinite casting ancestral with white too. Yes, but that's any spell. Literally any spell is infinite in that case. So I can look at any spell and be like, oh, it's infinite, guys. Look, it's an infinite combo. Look, I can take Thirst for Knowledge because it's an infinite combo. Look, Dark Petition, Infinite Combo. Uh, Geist of St. Traft makes an angel. So we're going to go with angels and swords. That seems like the correct play here. Okay. Angels and swords. Also, Thalia has a sword, so she comes back. Like, oh, that's cool. Oh, a Lyra. Gotta go Lyra. I would like this control magic, but I'm gonna go Lyra. Because we have to. We have to. That's our. <clears throat> that's our. Uh, you know what I'm saying. Yeah. Da 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 da. All right. See, on one hand, angels and swords are not super powerful in terms of cube cards. On the other hand, I've won with a good a good number of angels. Do we just have to take Iona here? Ooh, that's rough. I mean, Sower is the much better pick. I don't even think Iona is playable, unfortunately. How similar to the same thing you just Hearthstone? Also, sorry. The, um, no, no, that's not over asked at all. Like, actually, no one asked that question. Um. Hearthstone is obviously derived from MTG, but as far as in-game similarities, there's very, very few. Other than, like, attacking and drawing cards, like, that's pretty much the... Like, the mana system is different, uh, the number of cards you can have in your hand is different, the, like, the combat is different. <clears throat> I'm gonna I'm gonna veto and take Sower here, just because I don't think I own as playable. Um... I guess it's just Selfless Spirit. We can take Ice, but I don't think Ice is that good. Selfless Spirit's actually probably pretty decent, especially with Geist of St. Traft. Uh, where are the swords? Elspeth is... Elspeth's really good. I don't see any, any, any other angels or swords, though. I like Lingering Souls. Oh, good. The Angel of Sanctions came back. Elspeth actually is an angel. <laughs> That's hilarious. <clears throat> I have Brightlings a Shapeshifter. Shapeshifters could be angels. Yeah, this card, I don't, I'm surprised that, like, this Elspeth is so good.
Lion's Eye Diamond. I'll just take Plateau. If we end up getting like a uh, Scalding Tarn or something, it's, it's a dual land. Boo -doo 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 -doo. The cube ends at 116 on at 5 p.m. Wow, that's late. Thursday at 5 p.m. Wow, Control Magic came back? The Iona was taken. That's pretty impressive. <coughs> would I say MTG has more depth? Yes, yes I would. Only because MTG has more options. Like, you can play cards on your opponent's turn. You're, you're, you're able to block. <coughs> like, there's a lot of reasons why. Like, as far as the, the the game rules and the game mechanics go, there's just more to magic. Angel of Invention. That is an angel. I worry about the number of five drops we're going to have. I'm going to take Seachrome Coast here. Do you get Vitas for fixing? I actually don't know. And this is probably going to come back anyway, so it's it's not like I'm ignoring it. Oh, um, Thank you. <clears throat> that might be, you might be right. Okay, yeah, I'd rather have the fixing because we have nothing to fix our mana right now. Uh, cool, cool, cool. Um, okay, so no angel. No, not, we haven't seen, we haven't even seen one sword yet. That's pretty funny. Usually we see like four of them. Valtrex, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Welcome back. Uh, Swarm Coil Engine? For mass is good, but like how many three drops are we going to have? I guess we can table lingering souls for now. Narset is pretty good, actually. Yeah, let's take the Narset. I like that. Do -do 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 -do. What did Foothills get to the Plateau? That's not great. Nothing in this pack is actually that great. Everflowing Chalice could be fine, I guess. What's this cast Elspeth earlier? <coughs> yeah, I was worried about our mana because now we have double white, double white, double blue, double blue, double blue, double white, double white, double white. Like, if you don't have fixing in the two color decks, like it's actually really difficult. We can take the Scraping Tar Pit. And just play the Lingering Souls with it. Nothing else in this pack really stands out to me. Would you say that League is to Dota as Harston? I would have that I have no idea of. I don't actually play any MOBAs. Flooded Strand. Yeah, we're taking that. Linvala might come back too. So we might have two angels on the wheel, which would be pretty sweet. I really just want Tundra and, and Hollow Fountain and Celestial Colonnade. Is that too much to ask? I just want to be able to cast my spells. What are your thoughts on anime? I'm not a huge anime fan. I don't mind anime. I just don't really. It's not really my thing. Uh, still no swords. I'll take a Gideon. Sure. Uh, do I stream full-time? Yes, that is my... That is my, uh, primary source of, of income. <laughs> Oh, Amiri Angel. Is Nicol Bolas uh, an angel? I don't think Thank so. Thank you. Amiri Angel it is. Jazz one, thanks so much for the resub, buddy. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. Oh, welcome, welcome. It's not even a resub, that's a regular sub, dude. How long you been full what is it? What what are these are a lot of questions, man? <laughs> I've streamed uh as my primary job for like probably two years now. Uh, I like when... Oh, sword. Wow, the first sword. It's actually a good one, too. Can we get more two drops? That'd be great. I'd be really all about the two drops. The unfortunate thing about angels and swords is none of them cost two mana. <clears throat> I'm 
Sword of War and Peace. Alright, we'll take it. Look, the Angel of Invention came back, guys. No, not disruptive. It just no, it just threw me off a little bit. I'm like, what's going on? Are you interviewing me right now? <laughs> I didn't understand what was happening. Brimaz. Dig through time. Hmm. So that's when I get bored, I click random streams and ask them questions. Hey, I'm okay with it. Do, 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 do. <clears throat> yeah, absence fine. Yeah, I don't hate it. Do I love it? No. Do I hate it? No. Let's take Terminus here. Alright, this last pack's gotta deliver for us. <clears throat> Look, the Linvala came back. All the angels that we wanted came back. See, it wasn't it wasn't uh it wasn't going against the step, it was it was strategically uh You know what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying. Wow, look at this late Nicol Bolas. People got no respect. Oh yeah, we even have Lyra, which is great. That is the Angel Lord. That's even funny, I've never even considered her the Angel Lord. That's that's something. Winds of Abandon came back? Holy smoke, that's great. I'm really glad there's no sword or angel in here, because I want this fractured identity like nobody's business. Oh, yeah. Getting fractured. Does Narsa seem hard? Why? Oh, oh, maybe, actually. No, she might. She not ideal. Oh, Azoria's Signet seems great. Yes. Excellent. Wait, what's going on? Oh, wow. <laughs> that was scary. I didn't actually pick it, but I guess we picked it. <clears throat> Angel of Serenity is a card we have not played. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Um, yeah, there's a bunch of streamers out there who just don't actually say anything comically enough. I guess we're just taking Angel here. Yeah, that signet was nice. That winds was nice. That fracture identity was nice. I don't even know why Angel of Serenity... Maybe, I mean, like, let's play. We've never actually played it. It was a house in standard. Like, I mean, getting back three of our creatures if it dies doesn't seem terrible. I don't know. It's a 5-6 flyer. Like, maybe it's really not as bad. I don't know. Like, has anyone actually played it in the cube? <clears throat> Oh, Baneslayer Angel? Oh, girl. This is a lot of, uh... <laughs> I'm gonna probably take this out for the sake of five drops. <clears throat> oh, Sword of Fire and Ice? Oh, that's a better sword than War and Peace. I'm gonna put this in the sideboard for now. I'm just making room for cards so we have, uh, so we don't... Oh, Celestial Colonnade. <clears throat> I think I like that more than Council of Judgment. Especially with our mana requirements. Yeah, we're going to take the... That's unfortunate. I mean, maybe with the way this key was going that we'll get the, uh, the Council's Judgment on the wheel. A boy can dream. A boy can dream. Boo -doo -doo -boo -doo. Boo -doo 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 -doo. <coughs> yeah, the wind's last pick says I just might, just might be able to grab it. 
Snatch it up. Snatch it up. Seven years I'm going to work at night. They call me the working man. Avison. Avison. All right. There are so many five drop angels. I'd rather play Avison than Angel of Invention. How many angels we got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This guy makes angels. It's kind of like eight. Gideon's good. Sphinx's rev is good. Interesting. I feel like we're more of a Gideon deck than a, than a Sphinx's rev deck. What do you think? Danto Vanguard? Thank you. That guy wears a sword. And he has a sword in his hand. Third Tail, thank you so much for the resub, buddy. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. Condemn? Scrubland? Do we get anything to Scrubland? <clears throat> no. We have Plateau and we have Scrubland. That's unfortunate. We could use the Scrubland and play Lingering Souls. <clears throat> Man, I wish my throat wasn't so scrunchy. I'm just going to take Condemn. Monastery Mentor. Okay. Is that better than... Not really. Like, we don't have a ton of spells is the problem, right? Like... <laughs> Should have picked that warm power stone instead of the bad angel card. Yeah, but unfortunately, that's not how stipulations work, my dude. Council's judgment, come on. Bring it home. Hero blade hold? Jesus. That's ridiculous. I don't think Flicker Wisp does much here. Containment Priest is cute. Thank you. GM Miller, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. <clears throat> Welcome back. Really appreciate it. Idiot. Oh, wow. That's a playable card. Jeez. Okay. Well, you can go over here. I don't think we care about unexpectedly absent as much now. Brightling, Brightling's all right. I, I'm I'm okay with Brightling. I'd be tempted to cut Linval. Linval is more of a sideboard card. And I could see cutting. I could see cutting Brightling maybe. Like, you just want to make sure you have enough cheap targets for swords and for, for Gideon. Like. Oh, what up, Monsonster? I don't really want to cut the 7 drop A because we've never played it before in B because it's an angel stipulation so I don't want to cut like too many angels we already have 2 in the sideboard we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 6 in the main deck with uh, Geist of St. Draft <clears throat> wow, you want to get three non-land permanents back with Angel of Serenity? That's insane. This actually does kind of seem like an 18-lander, so we're probably going to play 18 lands, make one more cut. It's just Hero of Bladehold. It doesn't feel right. I think it's Brailing over Hero of Bladehold. One, two, three, four. Uh, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. No, yes, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Just do it like that. <clears throat> Hero seems like it dies without doing anything. Wow, that has not been my experience with Hero, but both playing it and being on the other side of it. <clears throat> 
Hero's insane. Hero just wins games. I do not think 75% of the time I won't get a swing. I think that seems like a crazy exaggeration. I've, <laughs> that has not been my experience. Three hundred percent of the time, it just doesn't get to attack. Yeah, I don't think so. It's not really. Could have Zorya Sigma here, but I think we'd rather just go with these two guys. Wow. Very aggressive. Get him with the, this guy. I see you rounders. What does that mean? I don't even know what that means. Wow, and they get hit fractured identity? Jesus Christ. Sure. Talk about the perfect card. That's something right there. <clears throat> I thought people exaggerated percentages like 600% of the time. But I could be exaggerating. Hard to say. Uh, okay. <clears throat> we have 18 lands. Let's see if we can draw a fourth land here. Wow. <laughs> Let's see if we can draw a third land here. Oh, God. Well, we have control magic, which they know about. Grizzlebrand, Ashen Rider, Sundering Titan. Well, here come the bad times. It's not correct to combine the meatballs with the pepper jack when provolone isn't available. It's never correct, which is the, the whole problem. Yep, Ashen Rider. You gotta get rid of Gideon here, but that just means I get to steal the Ash? Oh, you get to rid of Colonnade? Fascinating. <coughs> Did you just exile this guy? I don't know. Seems fine. Burn, 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 burn. Fucking Christ. Well, wow, you don't get Sundering Titan back there, so now if I draw a blue, I just get to steal this guy? That's weird. <clears throat> But I didn't. I didn't draw the blue, so we can probably concede now. 18 lands, and we miss. Turn six, we, we missed three land drops in our 18 land deck, guys. That's pretty cool. Containment priest. Do 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 do. Let's take out. Let's take out Angel of Serenity. Uh, hmm. Actually, Angel of Serenity is not. Yeah. Hmm. 
I got one of the swords here. I mean, let's let's consider that that the opponent drew as many swords almost as we drew lands. So, <clears throat> you know, that's a that's a cool thing. We're having a good time. Everybody's having a good time. This is 100% why I don't put strip mine in my cube because it's just not fun. Oh man. Are we going to lose to mana again? Because that's really sad. Maybe if you didn't want to get your Colonnade strip mined, you shouldn't have let on Colonnade. <clears throat> hey, that's pretty good. Alright, let's see what happens. Oh, nothing. Nothing happened. Oh, let's actually I'm gonna add a, I'm gonna use a blue for this instead. This is where they go in tomb at the end of the turn. No, they didn't in tomb. What up to Chelly? Okay, buried alive, sure. You're getting too here comes a lush norn. I'm gonna put a Leshnorn in my graveyard. <clears throat> oh, no, just Gristlebrand, Ashen Rider. So I assume you have Sundering Titan in your hand. Wow. That's fantastic. Hey, we missed our second land drop. <laughs> no, just our first one. This is our first one. I don't want to exaggerate here. 18 lands and a signet. Yep. They the the other the other deck though. They got they got all their lands, so that's good. What two do we keep? I think we keep Angel. Maybe not. Reason being, like, we can still play this. <laughs> yep. They're at 12. What are the odds we can get by with just this Angel of Sanctions? <laughs> Literal zero. Oh, Lord. <laughs> okay. All right. Good times. <clears throat> okay, well, that's a thing you can activate and get back a fucking gristle brand with. Amazing. Oh, let's put a control magic under that bad boy. <clears throat> I'm 
Man, I wish I had haste, huh? I'll discard an island. Wow, now we have Sower, Control Magic, Ancestral Winds, Condemn. Well, they definitely drew a creature in their, in their seven cards, I presume. Okay. I mean, this is the last creature in their graveyard, so. They call me the working man. Hmm. It's pretty good. One, two, three. So we're going to go to six cards. Then we're going to draw go to seven cards. Then we're going to go to ten cards. Right, wins doesn't target it, so it gets rid of it. Um, six, seven, eight, nine. We'll have ten mana. Four, five, six, seven. No, we'll have eight mana. So we can't go wins and then, like, Zendikar or Gideon. Um... <clears throat> The question is, do we need this right now? We can go wins, keep up control magic, which seems pretty good. Five, six, seven. I mean, it gets them, they're, they're probably just going to come down and cast the, uh, the Sundering Titan that's clearly in their hand. Why are we dropping so many fucking frames? Um... Yeah, I don't think we need that yet. I think we just save the Ancestral until our hand is a little less. Well, that's interesting. So if they kill two lands, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, we'll still have ten lands. We'll still have enough lands to cast Angel next turn. And we can actually get rid of all of these guys. And if they play like Sundering Titan, we can actually steal it during their turn. They still have seven cards in their hand. This is a real this is a real attrition war if I ever saw one. <clears throat> There he is. There's your boy. Everybody's losing two lands. Do, 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 do. Put it in your pantry with your cupcakes. Yep, you got it. Look around me, oh, you see how simple that the guys. Bam, bam, bam. Actually, do we want to do that now? <clears throat> I feel like we kind of do, right? I guess that's fine. They're tapped out, right? So they're just dead. Like, they don't know we have Sower, so I don't think they need to here. Good lord. I guess they didn't know we have Rift Wing either, because we didn't suspend it. We just drew it. I don't know. Linval is good at, like, turning off Bristlebrand, but that's pretty much it.
<clears throat> Actually, unexpectedly absent seems good here. I don't know why I took it out. I mean, having a control magic and a sower seems pretty good here. Actually, I don't even know if sword is any good against them, ironically. Like, making them discard is, seems pretty decent. Um, yeah, I think we do want to just fire and ice. Yeah, I was thinking Terminus, but we already have we already have Winds of Abandon, which is also another six mana card. So I don't, I don't think we want too many of those. Yeah, it's fine. Alright, let's try this opening again. Let's see if we can hit more lands, though. In before turn around library, I'll... Oh, wow, no, li no library. Good times. Wow. Well. <clears throat> Angel in opening hand. What would Flicker Wisp do? Oh, they got rid of Winds of Abandon. Fascinating. The nation turns its lonely eyes to you. Woo woo woo. <clears throat> Yeah, they're not tokens, they're just they're just reanimating guys, and you're like, all right, I'll blink your guy, and you're like, oh no, I guess it's just fine. Last thing I want to do is blink an Ashen Rider or a Sundering Titan. Yeah, searching for Vampiric Tutor is pretty scary. Hey, Buttershoot, we're going to be doing our server on Friday, I believe. So long as Rob does not have to cancel. Collective Brutality again? Every game. Interesting. <clears throat> I think we're just Gideoning here. Assuming they won't have a reanimate spell right now, right? seems bad. I mean, even if they did, they would just take our... Oh, wow, they didn't have anything. That's interesting. You're gonna counter my signet? You're gonna dismember my Gideon. Okay, sure. Just watched you and Mike take on the giant squid monster. Seemed pretty fun, although the inventory equip situation was pretty. It's just, it's just exhausting. Are we winning due to their? Oh, we're just gonna hold up that. Oh yeah, we don't need to play no Lyra. Guys, the Saint Draft's got it covered, my dudes. I think they have necromancy in hand. One O, swords and angels, my dudes. 
I feel like we're dropping a ton of frames and I really don't know why. I'm sorry, guys. There's nothing going on on my internet, so. Oh, what up, Kerwit? The old... I don't even know what the Frank box is. I think you just made that up, my dude. Oh my god, it did it again. Dude, these fucking camera settings are unreal bad. Why can't you just remember? Is it because the backlight? Does that keep going on? Yeah, the backlight compensation keeps going on. Just stop. You don't have to do it. I'll keep this hand because of, because of your boy. <clears throat> yeah, I'm sure it's mad choppy. You know why? Because Spectrum is hot trash. I want to message Felipe and be like, are you doing any sort of internet things? Thank you! House of Shadow, what's going on, buddy? Really appreciate it. Welcome back, my dude. The rest train? What's the rest train? Okay, we're in combat now. Let's try to avoid that. Okay. <laughs> I was like, why didn't we... Why don't we have a main phase? God, what if they have... What if they go, like, Godless Shrine Mana Tithes? What if they go Island Days? Wow, we drew two lands. Exceptional. They require you to rent a router for them from, from for ten dollars a month. Good lord. Wow, you deserve to get days. Do people deserve things? That's crazy. I'll never understand when people say you deserve bad things. That's so weird. You deserve this negative thing to happen to you. That's weird to me. Oh, your resub went through. I even read it. And I was like, what's the rest train? I even thanked you for it. That's weird. Are you going to remand this guy? Wow. Real original, buddy. Yeah, Felipe's like just watching Twitch. Nothing crazy. Yeah, that should not be an issue. Well, that's a cool story.
oh my god, I didn't plus this idiot because I was like, there's nothing to do. In my head, I'm like, well, there's nothing to do with this guy, so I might as well not plus it. Wow, that's terrible. Doesn't matter anyway, I guess. <laughs> Oh good, I like that they use this pre-combat. That's great. He's got five cards in hand. Jesus. Mystic Confluence. Oh, just fucking mana drain. Cool. In my face. How about them bands? That's a good combo. Probably one of my favorites. Dude, that's insane. <laughs> wow. So if we play this, they can kill it. They could turn it into an elk and then kill it. Hmm. I mean, we have five. They have five cards. We have three lands in hand, and we played Ancestral, so... Yep, cool. I don't even care anymore. Like, this game is not winnable, unfortunately. Um... Five hundred, five hundred. How's it, Brett? Can you, can you send me a shot of your speed test right now to see? I want to just want to see what you're actually getting, because that sounds nuts. Thank you. Oh, Zdre, what's going on, buddy? Is it actually Zdre or is it Zydrate now? I don't even know which. I don't even know what's real anymore. I mean, Linval is meh. I'm a normal YouTube watcher. Thanks for the answer. Hey, Artemic, thank you so much for saying so, man. Really appreciate it. This hand's pretty bad. This hand's not that much better. I'll keep it. Because I don't want to go to, four, I don't go to five. Like, come on. It's like the same hand. <laughs> Corporate wants you to find the differences between these two hands. It's the same hand. Our opponent's name is Najoy, which is exactly what they're giving us. It's giving me Najoy to play against you, my dude. Two drop. Adato Vant. Okay. Blades is fied. Oh. Oh, they're just going to remand it, so. Oh, God. My exhaustion is real. Okay, well, do we just get to slam him again? Looks like we do. Okay. 
Tantrum, that's the point he's making. Yeah. That's why I said until now. But now I'm a Zedre. Wait, what's the difference? Z, they gotta be pronounced differently though, right? Oh, yes. You're going to turn this into an elk? Oh, yeah. We are d -d -d doing it, my dude. To see you again. So the question is, do we take out Oko, or do we make them discard untap? If we play Lyra and they get to keep Oko on board, it's just terrible for us. So... Brett, your down is 477. You're up is five. You're up is higher than your down. <laughs> Jesus. And that's only 55 a month from Frontier. Do you have a contract? What the fuck? That's insane. I'm actually what? That's... What? I'm pretty sure we just kill Oko. Um, hello. My name is Robert. Wow, can you imagine if Oko was restricted in Vintage, Banned in Modern, Banned in Pioneer, and Banned in Standard? Can you talk about a better barometer for a terrible card? Wow. That's insane, dude. I have never heard of such a thing. So if they have an answer for the sword, though, it's real bad for us. That's the problem. So I'm almost tempted to get rid of this guy. It's not great. We get a signet, though, don't we? That is what white people say when someone drifts into the lane while driving. Uh, hello. I'm driving here. I get nervous and try to break. He does. He does get nervous. It's true. What they have? They can have a rough to get. They didn't play anything for five mana. I feel like hitting this is probably bad, right? Ugh. Losing our sword and our geist. All for four damage. It's gonna be a, it's gonna be a, uh, an Orzhov saving because that's what the card is. To see you again. Oh, they're gonna they're gonna manage in this, and then they still get to keep up the other cards. Yeah, that's brutal. Sweet full five color deck. All right, well. Yeah, I'm not I'm not doing all that jazz. I mean if they if this is what they're thinking of like, do I cast it now anyway? Alright, cool. So theoretically that would have never resolved. So we'll see if it, they have to actually have any Thank you. Anything good to do with them. David Styles, thank you so much for the resub, buddy. Nineteen months. Good lord. Closing on two years. 
It means I gotta download all of the uh, the Theros cards. Uh, new folder. O one white. O four red. O five green. Mystic Confluence just to draw three, huh? O six gold. And land. Okay. Sure. Now they're going to kill the sword. Yep. Well, I was I was betting on Assassin's Trophy or uh, Abrupt Decay. Winter, spring, summer, or fall. All you got to do is call. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Oh, that's bad. That's sad. I didn't want to give them another turn with Varaska, but I guess it's fine. I don't know. It's not great. I was going to activate this and attack them, but maybe that's maybe it's not so bad. All right. Well, they would have just killed my colonnade anyway, so it doesn't really matter. All you gotta do is call. Maybe they had nothing for for the sword, which is pretty hilarious if that's the case. Wow, I thought the sand was pretty nuts. Geist of Saint Traft and a sword. Cool. Mono planeswalkers over here. Yeah, this is really hard to beat. Sack of Wolf, pretty easy choice. What? Alright, well. I mean, they still have three cards in hand, and this Garrick is really hard to deal with. If only we still had Fractured Identity. They have four cards to our one card, which is a land. We've drawn nine lands and four spells this game, so I don't really, like... I don't know. Games like this, I'm like... I guess this is just how my life is. <laughs> just another day in the simulation, guys. I'm sorry you've drawn so many lands in the past two days. Me too, buddy. Me too. Let's see how many of these are lands. Oh my god, if all three of them are lands, I would probably just... <laughs> Essentially two of them. Wow. There's no way to win this game, right? Like, we attack with Colonnade here, they still have one toughness on this guy, and they attack for 30. Like, eh, what are you going to do? Thank you. Yeah, this hand's fine. 
Dankus, thank you so much for the resub, buddy. Welcome back. Too busy to catch the stream recently. It's, is Outer Worlds still happening? Outer Worlds has not been happening for a while now, my dude. It was very good, though. I can't tell you how many hands I've had a Danto Vanguard and Gideon Blackblade in. It's probably been like five out of seven. My hair's not on point today? Really? What's that mean? Man, I thought my hair was looking fine. Yeah, Najoy, I actually didn't attack because I figured, I mean, like, I didn't know what you had. So you could have had, like, Abrupt Decay, Assassin's Trophy, Colagons, like, any number of cards that just destroy the sword and then I'm just totally blown out by it. So... Oh god, you're gonna make me choose between Ancestral, Allspeth, and Angel? Yeah, honestly, I don't think it would've made a difference if you had, like, the way the game played out, but... I mean, I was just trying to play it safe, because, like, I mean, and then I just... I mean, Mana Leak's a... Mana, Mana Drain's a pretty busted card, so... Yeah, I'm pretty sure it actually is Elspeth, but geez, putting an Ancestral underneath is... Actually, we have a lot of gas in our hand. Does that matter? I don't think it even matters. Whatever. Ugh. Oh my god, why did I F6 there? I don't know, because I'm an actual idiot. Wow, that was so bad. I mean, we get quite a few activations of Jace here. That's not too... Wow, that's so bad. This seems terrible, but, like, we literally can't cast anything else in our hand. This is why you need fixing, guys. This is why fixing is so important in these decks. Oh, uh, I saw the Morbius trailer today, actually. It actually looks alright. I like the Vulture cameo at the end. That was pretty sweet. Looking for a planes. Gonna get a sea chrome coast. <laughs> it's 
It's good enough to keep, unfortunately, but we can't really play anything this turn. So I guess we just take four more. Oh, I, I have not yet played Breath of the Wild. Fractured Identity. That was a good one. Probably the best one. Comically, we can't even... Uh, why do lands hate you so much? Buddy, I don't even know. I wish I knew. 18 lands in the deck. <sighs> I don't want to flip this because then he gets it. So I guess we're in bad shape here. Literally nothing to do. Mono, mono, double white, five drops and four drops in my hand. Uh, yeah, we can't equip the sword, otherwise he gets protection from control magic and then our opponent gains control. No, Mike does not fire up my stream <laughs> when I'm not here. Uh, I do not allow Mike at my personal computer. Not like I don't allow it, but that'd be weird if he just came in my room and started logging onto my things. Yeah, these lands are all... These lands are something, my dudes. There we go. One land hand. Guys, I don't know what to say. I don't know what to tell you. Like, I hate the, I hate these matches. I don't think they're fun. I don't think they're enjoyable from a viewer's perspective. Like, I'm, I, I apologize that uh, <laughs> we've been drawing like this, but what are you going to do? Draft well? What does that mean? I can't tell if you're implying I didn't take fixing high enough when I when I literally took every fixing card that I saw, or if you're implying that I don't know what you're implying actually. It doesn't seem helpful though. And we have two five drops in our hand, and like. We only have four lands for the entire game, so I don't really see how fixing is going to prevent that, but... Jesus, I literally just shuffled you away. Or I guess I, I mean, I, I mulliganed you to the bottom and then I shuffled you back to the top, I guess. Sounds good. At least we get to play Gideon, he said. Oh, cool. What does this even do? 
It does nothing. And then we get hit for seven. And then we have to replay our fourth land. And then we get hit for another seven. So we take 14, and then we get to play one of these two cards. Is that... Does that do anything? <laughs> Yeah, I mean, it might just be worth ultimating because we have so much to do that it's like... For actual identity, we're not going to be able to play for two turns. Like... Like, they're going to play this. They're going to attack for seven, bounce our land. We get to play our fourth land again. We take another seven. We're going to take 14 damage before we get to play for extra identity. Or Angel of Sanctions. And that's presuming that they don't play something else. Like, like a Teferi. <laughs> They're like ramping themselves by bouncing their mocks and what they, they did they tap their mocks for a blue then like replay it with no benefit. That's weird. Why would you like why? <laughs> it's so weird. So Fractured here could be good. Let me bounce the Lyra. All you gotta do is call. Which means, like, the problem with Angel is that if they have any way to kill with the Angel, then they just get killed. Then we're just dead. So if we play Angel... Garrett of Lyra, end of turn, they go for the third, it we're dead. If we play Fractured to get rid of Riftwing Clouds, or to, to, to get rid of Riftwing, Riftwing, I mean, it doesn't give us Lyra. I mean, if they have a counter or, or anything, like, we're just dead here, so. Yep, so I guess we're dead. Toxic Deluge for two. Sure. Wait, what? Wait, what just happened? Wasn't that game one? Oh no, we got wrecked. Did Was that the same match? Huh. Oh well, what can you do? Yeah, I guess that was... Wow, that didn't even feel like the same match. I don't know. Maybe I'm... I don't know. Either way, Doomsday, thank you for the stipulation. Even though I feel like our biggest enemy was our mana base. And uh, what can you do? Thank you guys for watching. Slam those. I think the I think the stipulations might have to be more strict for Cube. For Vintage Cube, rather. Because if you don't, you don't want stipulations that are going to restrict your ability to compete on the same level as your opponents. Or if you do, then you just have to be like, eh, it's fine. We'll just lose some... We're not going to We're not going to win as much, but like... You know, you just have to accept that in the beginning, I think. Um, but, like, yeah. Also, I think some of these cards should just not be in the queue, but that's a conversation for a different day. Thank you so much for the support, my dude. Really appreciate it. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Check me out at CoolStuffInc.com every Wednesday. Patreon.com slash FranklinPore. Twitch.tv slash FranklinPore. And uh, ManaTraders.com, who has an awesome subscription service. You can get 20% off the first three months of any subscription with the link and promo code down below. So be sure to check that out. I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.